Hi everyone, welcome to Wish Problem. So today we will be looking at class 8 M4 polynomials per package. First question. So the question says n factorial is equal to 56 into 6 factorial. So we have to find the value of n. Okay. So let's do that first. Here. In the equation we can see that 56 into 6 factorial. So first let's just slip, uh, split it with 56. Okay. So 56 8 into 7 into 6 factorial. Right? So now 8 factorial, right? Because 8 into 7 into 6 into 5 into 4 into 3 into 1. 2 into 1. So that is 6 factorial. So when you multiply all this, it's going to be 8 factorial only, right? So n factor is equal to 8 factorial. And when you remove this factorial, it will become n value 8. And your option is B. Now let's look at the second question. So second question is 4 by 3 fact whole factorial. So this is undefined. That it is not defined because uh, fractions do not have factorial. Okay, this is one of the rule we have. So option D, third one, we have minus 5 factorial. So for negatives also we don't have for uh, Oh, factorial. So, it's option D again does not exist. Now, let's look at the fourth question. So, the given rate of fourth question is NC4 is equal to total and find the value of N. So, in this question, how we are going to do is we will find do with the formula itself. So, first, N4 factorial we have to find that means R factorial, right? So, N into N minus 1 into n minus 2 into n minus 3 divided by 4 into 3 into 2 into 1. So this is the formula based on that I wrote this equal to 2 10. So nc4 will be this. Right? This is the formula for nc4. Okay? Then what will happen? We will uh, put this. We will send this to RHS. Okay? So first you multiply it. So 3, 2, 6, 6, 4 is 24. So 24 will be substituted to move to RHS. So n into n minus 1 into n minus 2 into n minus 3 is equal to 210 into 24. So this is the format which we are going to get. And when you simplify you are going to get this one when you multiply. You are going to get 5040. So n into n minus 1 into n minus 2 into n minus 3 is equal to 5040. Then, what we can do? We can split this, right? 5040 can be split into, so write first n into n minus into n minus 1 into n minus 2 into n minus 3 is equal to, so this 504, first it is uh, 9 into 8 into 7, 504, then 10. So, we can write it as 10 into 9 into 8 into 7. Now you can see that it is all 10 factorial. Right. So the greatest number will be we will be taking there. Why we are taking greatest number in the previous uh, challenges also we took like that. Why? That one I will say now. See now if, I, if you take n as 10 then 10 n, n minus 1 is 10 minus 1. 10 minus 1 is 9. 10 minus 2 is 8. 10 minus 3 is 7. That's it. Very simple reason you have, right? If somebody asks you, you are going to say this. So, n is equal to 10 and option D. Now, let's look at the fifth one. So, the given data in uh, fifth question is NP3 is 1320. So, we have to find the value of n. Right? This is the given data there. So, how we should do that is first, this NP3 formula we will be using first. It is n into n minus 1. Actually, this is not the formula. So we have to split it like this because 3 are there now. 3 into 2 into 1 like that. Okay. So in such a way we will do is equal to 13, 20. Because we just split this. So and this equation will be the same itself. Now 13, 20 how can we write that? So in the previous videos also we learned that 12, 11 is 132. So first write that 12, 11. And that 0 for that 0 we will write 10. Okay. 
Now, you can see that again they are consecutive, like fourth question only, where n value will be 12. Because n will be 12, 12 minus 1 is 11, or 12 minus 2 is 10, that's it. Okay? So again n value is 12. So 10, n value is 12, and option is C. Now, sixth one. So the sixth one given data is 18665 plus 18606, sorry C6, 18C5 plus 18C6 is equal to NC13. So you have to find the value of N here, okay? Same thing, N value is equal to question mark, okay? Now, so how we will do? We will do with a formula called NCR plus NCR minus 1 is equal to n plus 1 cr so you all remember this formula i guess because uh, we did it recently itself in the challengers first main okay so we used this not the first main second one we used this formula so how we will do using this formula we'll see now so this one when you put it uh, this side also it's same right now i'll take example 1 plus 2 is equal to 3 it is like that only now if I take 2 plus 1, then it is going to be 3 only, right? No change. Only the digits are moved, but answer is same. So in such a way only, we will be moving this here and this one there. Okay, let's do, I'll erase that. So I wrote it like that. Now, it is in the form of this formula right now, correctly. So, when you add up what it is going to be is 19 C6. That's it. The answer is formed. That is equal to NC13. So, here, the down numbers are changed. It's not same. Don't worry. This N will be 19. That's it. Okay. So, up number will be mattering. N is 19. Option A. Okay. Next question. So, in this question, we have to find the middle term in X plus uh, 1 by x plus 1 by x power 2n this n okay so in this we have to find the middle term by expanding it so the formula as we all know tn by 2 plus 1 so this formula we will be using so uh, n will be this one right so it is 2n so t 2n divided by 2 plus 1 Fine, so this 2, 2 will get cancelled here. Then, Tn plus 1. Right now, Tn plus 1 is equal to NCR into X into N minus R into A power R. This is the formula, right? We all know this. In, the pre in many challenges questions also, we learned this. Now, n is 2n, right? Because this is actually considered as n. So, but value is 2n. So, we will write 2n. Okay. Next. In, into x. x power n minus r, right? So, this cn, don't forget. C, r, n, c, r. So, that is cn. r is cn, right? For us. And this is the formula, right? So, cn into x into x power 2n minus n into 1 by x power so r is n done now next we have to simplify simplification of 2n c r into 2n minus n is n so x power n into 1 by x power n now x power n, this 1 power n, 1 by x whole power n can be written like 1 power n, n into x power n. So, in that case, if you take, it will be 1 power n, x power n. You can cancel these two. Right, next. So, the answer is going to be 2n, c, n. So, here it's n only, so you forgot it. So, that is going to be the answer. Okay, now let's uh, look at the ninth one. Sorry, eighth one. So, eighth question is the term assertion A. 
the term independence of x in the expansion x plus 1 by x plus 2 whole power 21 is 42 c 21. So this is correct only. A is true and R reason. In the binomial expansion the middle term in independent of x is independent of x. That is wrong. So reason is false option C. Here I am writing. Ninth one statement type question. Uh, first statement A. If n factorial is 24 then n is 4. That is correct only. So statement A is true. Statement B. If 15 C 2 R minus 1 is equal to 15C 2R plus 4 then R value is 3. We have to verify whether it is correct or wrong. This one I will say how to do. So statement B in 9th one. Okay how you have to solve I am saying now. So 15C 2R minus 1. Right this is the is equal to 15C 2R plus 4. And R value is 3. We have to just put 3 in place of R. Very simple. So this is like NCR is equal to NCS. Fine. So N is equal to R plus S. Then 15. N is 15. This is NCR means this will be N right. 15 is equal to 2R minus 1 plus 2R plus 4. So S means this all. R means this all. Okay. So both we have to add it. So this is a shortcut. Like formula. Instead of putting that R, we will not know how to solve all this. So this, is, this method is correct. Fine. Then when you do it, 15 is equal to 4R plus 3. Right? Then 4R is equal to 12 because minus 3 goes to LH, sorry, plus 3 goes to LHS and become minus 3. Then we'll have 4R is equal to 12 and R value is 3. So we found the value of R itself. Okay. So it's correct only option A. Ninth one. Now let's look at the 10th one. So 10th one statement A. 9C3 plus 9C4 is 10C4. We using that formula. We can do that one. I uh, will just rearrange that and uh, we will do A is true. Statement B. NCR minus 1 plus NCR is equal to N plus 1 CR. Using this formula only we found A. So it is obviously correct only. T, uh, T we will put an option A. Then 11th one. The value of 0 factorial. 0 factorial is option A 1 and option D 1 factorial because 1 factorial is obviously 1 only. So option A comma D. Then 12th one the product of first 20 natural numbers is denoted as. So product is nothing but factorial only if you want to know a natural numbers first 20 means obviously we will start from 1 to 20 only. Factorial also from 1 only we will write. We will not include 0. So that's why it's going to be 12 factorial. Sorry, sorry, sorry. 20 factorial. That is one option. And in the introduction we can see that it is like this also. It, it is indicated in the form of factorial itself. And D option we have 1 into 2 into so on till into 20. This is also correct option only. Answers are A, C, D. This is multi answer. Okay. Now let's look at the emerald package. In the next video. Do like, share and subscribe to Wishfablooms. Thanks for watching our video. Do like. Bye.